Slayers Unleashed is the most recent game on Roblox that has put Roblox on fire. Since the update has recently been carried out, there are huge loads of players who've been experiencing issues leveling up. Are you one of them? Then look no further, as we'll guide you now. First of all, you'll need to click Customize for creating your character, and then you'll get spawned in a town. Once you get your first character, you'll have to talk to a girl named Megan. Focus on what she says, and then go do her mission. For getting your niche new sword, you'll have to go to the katana shop, and then you'll find another guy with whom you'll have a word with, and the name of the guy is Prexo. You'll buy katanas from him. The most expensive katana is the Tang Zhang, and that costs 500, and the prices of the other two are 250 and 150 respectively. You can buy any katana according to your own preference because there's no such difference in the working of the katanas. And the only difference is of the customization and the look of the swords. Once you're done selecting the katana, just start spinning. Then move to the Discord server and there you'll find all the codes you have. You'll see codes for demon arts, breathing, race, clan, and slayer marks. Now, for redeeming the codes, go to the chat and type it in there. Then there's a need to join the group instead of getting lost in the world of groups. Search for Slayers Unleashed version 0.66 and click the green sign. This will publish the game. Now here, you'll see the only group that you need to join. Easy, right? Just put the codes in after joining and you're good to go. The rest of the groups won't help you in any way, so it's better if you don't waste your time on them and get straight to the point. Now, get back to the game and meet the guy named Jared. He's basically a seller of different accessories. If you feel like buying any, then go ahead and get your favorite one. Otherwise, there'll be another dude, Op, who will ask you to buy coats from him if you're feeling cold. The element of humanity is getting too common in Roblox, isn't it? Well, this is how you'll meet different people at several spots from whom you can buy stuff for your convenience or according to your needs. It isn't compulsory to buy anything from each seller. These are just the options, or you can just save facilities for you so you can avail the one that you think is good for you or will help you in the game. You will have a number of choices to select from too. Leveling up in the Slayers Unleashed is the most important task, but it takes a lot of people confused about how they can actually do it. At present, there are just two ways that you can use to step up rapidly in Slayers Unleashed, which depends on an anime demon slayer. To level up in a fast manner in Slayers Unleashed, players are expected to go to Anthony and take a journey and kill five evil spirits that are totally futile. Whenever you have dispensed with the five evil spirits, head over to a shop and purchase a katana again. Subsequent to buying the katana, you should menace the log and rehash a similar cycle until your level is expanded. The second technique likewise needs you to visit Anthony and take a journey. Once acquired, you can go to the farmer's bootay. At that point, when you meet him, he will pose you an inquiry. Hey, are you interested in farming? You simply just click yes. When you do so, he will ask you one more inquiry. Would you like to help me farm or would you like to buy my fork? When you react decidedly, he'll ask you once more. Are you sure you would like to purchase my farming fork for 75 yen? To acquire a mission from the farmer Bute, you should purchase the farming fork. To step up in the game, you should rehash a similar interaction until you level up. So, have you grabbed the basic concept of the Ultimate Slayers Unleashed? Let me know in the comments section below.